Wake up, mama. Turn your lamp down low. Wake up, mama. Turn your lamp down low. You got no nerve, baby. You got to turn your uncle John from your door. I woke up this morning, had them Statesboro blues. Woke up this morning, had them Statesboro blues. I looked up at Grandma, yeah, you know that Grandma's got them too. Mama died and left me, my papa died and left me I ain't good looking baby, but I'm sure and kind I'm going down the country, baby do you wanna go? Now your sister lives here, she come and tell me that she wants to go Well I love that woman better than I ever seen I love that woman better than I ever seen. She treat me like a king, yeah, and she sure look like a doggone queen. Wake up, mama, turn your lamp down low. Wake up, mama, turn your lamp down low. Got no nerve, woman, got to turn your Uncle John from your door. Third time's a charm, right? All right. It was worth waiting for, Joe. <laughs> Thank you for persevering. Before we go on, I just want to say that um, each of the artists tonight has experienced trouble with technology. And, you know, this is life on the Zoom world, right? Um, as Taz Cruz said, it's the effect of Mercury retrograde uh, happening right now in February. I just read a little something about that. It's uh, how does Mercury retrograde affect me? Expect to have more or less energy than you're used to, particularly of the nervous variety. So it'll either sap you of your usual zest and leave you feeling lethargic or fill you with the chaotic scattered energy that might have you feeling restless and focused and anxious. So we're just going to relax, take a breath and bring Joe back. And Joe, I want to ask you too, if you would um, actually turn your guitar up a little bit. I like to hear a little more of that. It sounded really good. Words a guitar player never hears. I absolutely will. I know, and I, I rarely say it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, the next one does feature the loop station again, so I'm going to get that set up, and once I have that done, I will unmute myself, and uh, we'll get into song number two. All right. Hi, Mom. <laughs> So I'm going to say hi, Mom, too, because uh, we'd always get to see your mom dancing at the blues jams. And we miss seeing all the folks who would come. And it's lovely to see those vintage jams play and seeing activity in life. So we're looking forward to that coming back, hopefully, this year. All right, this one's probably a little bit more untraditional, um, but it's done by SRV and 
a whole host of other people, uh, but he's certainly the, uh, the version that I'm trying to copy here. Uh, I'm going to get wild and crazy and try to use as many pedals in my pedal board as I can and hopefully give you guys something a little different other than like a resonator guitar with a slide. Not that that's bad, because one day I hope I can play that, but right now I'm just going to stick with what I know. All right.
Dan is back. Land the spaceships. <laughs> Holy shit, that was freaking sick. <laughs> that. Oh, I'm glad I did that then. I yeah, didn't know how that would fun. be received. <laughs> All right, so I'm going to switch gears and grab my uh, trusty Martin. Okay. And we'll do a little acoustic for you. All right, sounds great. Right, so Joe um, is from the Harrisburg area and now lives in Maryland. So uh, we used to get to see him at the uh, at the jam regularly, and now we have to meet him at his house. You're all welcome. All right, we'll stop by when we're done. Need a guitar chord? Yeah, you got one? Yeah, a couple. <laughs> <laughs> I see you, you know, have setting some up landscape has also changed in 2020 slash 2021. Yeah. So you have some interesting instruments on your wall. A couple a mandolin, a fiddle. Do you play fiddle too? Oh, I don't play it. Um okay. I tried to play it and maybe yeah, you hard. can teach me one day. I can do a major scale and okay. it's it's very much, it's tuned the same way as a mandolin, right? Right, right. Um, and I can kind of play a mandolin. It's always been a passion to play fiddle and not violin or, you know, mm -hmm. if I could do either one, I really don't care. But right. Um, I have one. I have a bass. I have three cigar box? guitars. A cigar box guitar. Yeah. Um, mandolin, fiddle, several acoustic guitars. I, I uh, planted a guitar at my parents' house so that I didn't have to travel any anymore with a guitar I can just nice. show up there and play it and um, and then I have the original Johnson half body acoustic electric that my now wife bought me when we were in high school wow in so wow uh, my house is littered with it. My, my wife's like you're a hoarder I was like no but these things are worth something sure <laughs> all right how's it do you guys have my acoustic yeah it sounds good good Go down 
to leave Elm. Put your money in your shoes. Women in deep Elm got them deep Elm blues. Oh, sweet mama, daddy's got them deep Elm blues. Oh, Jerry Garcia band tune for you there. Nice. So is that the kind of music? Uh, is that what you're playing in your whiskey narrow string band? Yes. Uh, well, that's one of them. We try to focus on, you know, we do everything. We do traditional bluegrass. Mm -hmm. uh, we try to do some like Americana folkish yeah. type stuff. Um, we're a five piece band. We have a fiddle, a banjo, my guitar. We have female lead vocals, myself as a vocalist and uh, stand up bass. And, um, you know, we'll cover everything. We do as anything from Daft Punk um, up to Get Lucky uh, to, like, old Joe Clark. Um, nice. And everything in between, Jerry Garcia Band. I very much come from a Stevie Ray Vaughan jam band type uh, background. And mm -hmm. our fiddle player is very m – she is a uh, high school music teacher, so she's very structural, and she plays a fiddle. She's very, mm -hmm. um, you know, Joe, you're trying to play this. And I'm like, well – it, the chord looks like this. Can you tell me what the, the notes are? And she's like, yeah, it's an A minor, blah, 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 blah. So it's wow. a great balance of, like, yeah. traditional versus um, improv. Mm -hmm. And um, once this COVID goes away, you know, we'll be up in uh, your area for sure and, and down in Baltimore great. if you guys want to venture down. We'd love to. Make sure you let us know so we can come and support you. What do you have next We'll do. Uh, and to that note, if you guys get a chance, anyone who's listening, if you can uh, get on Facebook and check out Whiskey Narrow String Band uh, and give us a like, we'd very much appreciate that. I am doing that right now as we're speaking. I'm going to post a link to their page. In Mariana is a um, fiddle player. We'd love to have you come up and join us. I would love to do that sometime. Good, good. All right, so how much time do I have? Time for one more, I hope. Uh, yeah, let's do one more. Okay, great. All right, uh, and before I start, I would like to wish a very special happy ninth birthday to Erilyn Tenney. Uh, she turned nine on Monday, and what a bad uncle I am. I forgot to <laughs> tell her, but I want to give her that shout-out now, and I hope she's smiling and feels very special because she is very special. She is the only female grandchild of my parents, wow. and there's, like, one girl and, like, nine boy grandchildren. So God bless her. She's got a lot of protection, but she's probably very bored. <laughs> Hello there, my old friend Not so long ago was still the end We played outside and poured down rain On our way up the road we started how it happens living life by the drop up and down road in a worn down shoes talking about good things and seeing them. you and your way and I stay behind we both knew it was just a matter of time Taking the line, it won't stop. It's how it happens, living life by the drop. No wasting time, we're alive today. And turn up the past, there's no reason. 
Sometimes in between us and means to an end. God, it's good to be here walking together, my friend. We're living on dreams. Mind keeps aching. It's how it happens living life by the drop. It's how it happens living life by the drop. That's how it happens living life by the drop. Thank you very much. I uh, very much appreciate oh, thank it. Hopefully you. you'll forgive my blunders to get started and have me back again if we have to do this again. Of 